guys, it's Daddy! We're just doing a quick video about what's on sale already. Black Friday is supposed to start the day after Thanksgiving, but everything's pretty much already starting to be on sale, so here we go. So Amazon.com and Marshall Headphones pretty much have the same prices on everything except for this one. I would go to Amazon right now because they're $100 on Amazon. $99.99 for the original Emberton. Overall, the Emberton original sounds just as good as the Emberton 2. It's just a matter of that stacking feature and IP ratings and battery. By the way, I've got affiliate links below for everything you're seeing me talk about, and I'm gonna keep it updated throughout the week so that way we can find out if anything else goes on sale. So keep your eyes peeled. So for Marshall stuff, I'm seeing a lot of stuff on sale, but I'm not seeing the new stuff yet. We've got the Marshall Major 4s for 100 bucks. These are a great over-ear headphone. Then we've got the Marshall Monitor 2s going for 199. I think I got my pair for like 280 or something with a discount code. So this is a really good deal if you just need a cheap pair of noise canceling headphones compared to what else is out there by like Sony and Bose. <laughs> if you're an InBuds person, they've got the Minor 3 going for 100 bucks and then they've got the Motif Active Noise Canceling going for 150 bucks. I haven't tried either of them, but if they're anything like the other quality of Marshall that I usually see, they're probably worth checking out. I'm seeing some smoking good prices for the Acton 2. It's going for 150 bucks, though I don't really like the Acton 2 personally. I think it sounds a little muffly and unimpressive. For 100 more bucks, you could step up to the Stanmore 2. It's just, it's got a little bit beefier of a sound. It, it gets pretty loud. And if you got 399 bucks to blow, here's the Marshall Woburn 2. This is actually a really good speaker. I like the Marshall Woburn 3 a little bit more for sound clarity but um, this is starting to get to be a little bit more reasonable price for Black Friday, so it might be worth checking out. This thing's like almost 20 pounds, but it, uh, that's because it has a lot of music stuff in it to make a loud sound. And they also have the less familiar Marshall Uxbridge for sale with either Alexa or Google Assistant. I remember picking it up when it first came out and it didn't work that great with Alexa, so hopefully they made some improvements, but the sound quality was actually pretty good on it. It's just. I kind of felt like it was an odd offering for Marshall. Also, I didn't like the plasticky materials on them, so. And unfortunately, I have yet to see any of the Marshall Home Series 3s go on sale. These, If these things went on sale, that would be amazing because they are really good. This is the Acton 3. This is a smoking good speaker. Also, the brown is beautiful. Here's the Marshall Willen, also not on sale, but um, I just, I really love this thing. Though the Tribit Micro 2 has been a top contender for small speakers. Another one I was hoping to see on sale but didn't see it is the Marshall Tufton. This is the biggest portable speaker Marshall makes. It's got a like a super buttery, creamy bass to it and I love the sound of it. And uh, it's got like a 20 plus hour battery. Um, not super waterproof, but ah, I wish it was on sale. So keep your eyes peeled for this one. 